Hey everyone, if you're watching this video, you probably can't log into your server with Visual Studio Code Remote SSH and you're probably getting an error similar to what I get here. And the frustrating part is that this happens right after everything was working just fine. Now, there are many reasons that um, this could happen. And in my opinion, troubleshooting each one of them is a waste of time, especially when there is a very fast fix that works almost every time. So I'm gonna quickly show you here how to resolve this problem. First thing that you need to do is open your terminal and SSH into the server. Now, once you're connected into the server, make sure you're into your user's home directory. And as you can see here, there is this directory called VS called dash server. When Visual Studio Code connect to your server, it installs this little folder here and all the important files that are needed for this connection between your local machine and this remote server to work are into that directory. And if those files get corrupted or the versions between what's on your server or on your local machine get out of sync, it usually causes this problem to happen when you can't connect to the server. Visual Studio Code in recent years has been very good with replacing this folder on connection but sometimes the corruption is at the point where visual studio code cannot self fix it and this is when you need to step in so once you're here and you can see this directory all you need to do is go ahead and remove that directory so rm-rf and then followed by the name of the directory and once you have that directory removed then you can go and try to connect again into your password. And as you can see, Visual Studio Code was able to successfully connect to your remote server. So as I said, it's a very easy fix. Again, it works most of the times. I'm sure somebody's gonna find a situation that this didn't help, but for me, I'd say 99%, this is the solution. So I hope this video was useful to you. If you liked it, please go ahead, click on the like button. And if you wanna see more of my videos, please go ahead and subscribe for my channel. Thanks for watching.